I'm getting into an endless abyss of gacha games without even playing them. Is this good? Is this bad? I don't know. You tell me, but today we are back with more Arknights reactions. Today I'm gonna be shaking some contingency contract themes. It appears contingency contract is a mode, a game mode of this crazy Arknights stuff. And it seems I'm gonna be reacting to the first one and newest one i don't know it seems to be from a new season so maybe there are lots of themes i don't know what i got myself into but please explain this to me because I, i'm confused as fuck you know i have been doing three themes per video so if you can suggest me three themes to react to with common themes right or subjects uh, i would appreciate it and whatever comment like subscribe but enjoy anyway comment like subscribe but most importantly enjoy check my patreon page if you want if not well let's get into this <laughs> Five vocals. Colors go doors again, take it to try to the minus pain away. Seems like you relayed. Good luck, the feathers on your back. You are so done. It's reflecting in your eyes. You are set up. And I think I might know why. It's your time, it's your time, and I can take it back. It's a fight to survive, and life is all you have. Okay, hold a second. Hold there a freaking second. Oh, this wasn't in my plans, man. Are you telling me we have a math rock slash dubstep hip hop ish banger? That's quite a blend to do. Holy fuck. To begin with, the vocals of the introduction were beautiful, were contagious. I don't know. There's something about that rhythm, about that particular clean voice tone that. It's just so appealing. Da, 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 da. It's so freaking beautiful. Da, 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 da. And after that absolute insanity. Absolutely, we have a very uneven groove in terms of, of, of syncopation, in, in terms of stability. It's really dynamic. Everything is moving. A lot guitars, drums, vocalists, dubstep effects, and insanity, and the electric guitar math rock riffs we have there are beautiful. I love them, man. Also, also the vocalist rapping is doing so in sextuplets, even more beautiful. Dagdi 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 da or whatever. That is what I like to listen to. The ribs. Very complex and interesting melodies. Now, the guitar is more rhythm. It's a rhythm guitar. Not crazy lead parts. I think we even have some background growly vocals. Wow, wow, wow. Incredible. And the build up. Oh, the introduction was the chorus actually. Oh. That post there. Oh. <laughs> and it keeps getting better no freaking way i love that in the chorus the drummer changed the feel a little bit or the groove at least and obviously the stop off like a fee 
Dix. Ah, oh, it's so freaking powerful. And it does surprise you. Up until here, it's more of a breakdown kind of groove. Like one, two, three, four, ba, 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 ba. Right, but in the second part of the chorus. It is hitting the two and four beats of the bar. Actually, the time feel feels <laughs> Double there. So again, the first part is one, two, three, four, and the second part of the chorus one, ba, two, ba, da, ba, da, ba. See, one, two, three, four is it's quite clever. Dab seb. Um, math metal chorish with rap <laughs> everything is in harmony man the riffs this kind of keywords In a chilling section, we deserved it, actually. Ah! Oh. Like oh. That pause is really clever, man. Oh! Evil as fuck, yes sir. This song has it all. It's amazing, man. It's amazing how they achieve to have soft and hard vocals at the same time. At the same freaking time, the singer's um, way of singing tone timbre is quite soft. It's on a medium high register also. So it's crazy how uh, when he's singing parts like like the fee next and some other it is completely different and we have both types of vocals at the same time he was doubling himself there are lots of uh, layers of vocals or well there is a layer of quite a lot of vocals there and obviously the vocalist deserves so much recognition but it was some um, production work to have the voices layered organized like that it was pretty enjoyable we almost never had or never only one voice at a time there were always i don't know three at least at the least or maybe two but i honestly think that three at least man it's incredible and different types of voices the growly ones the more clean vocals the melodic ones is i don't know this freaking ost is excelling in almost every aspect in every aspect i mean this is what any of us would dream of with a banger of an ost track what can i tell you this is perfection the closest thing to perfection
the phoenix the phoenix shit i know this is a gacha game maybe the gameplay isn't even that great because you know how people is always criticizing this type of games but i can't believe we have these types of music they put a lot of effort and attention and and, and love soul into this holy holy and it turns out that, that was only the lobby dim it was supposed to be playing in a lobby that is not fair man <laughs> it's not fair that banger is i don't know i don't know a final boss material but now we have the actual battle theme i expect one even better man it would be tough but i don't know let's see what happens okay I like the multi-rhythm approach to this. Oh, oh! Oh, yes, fucking sir. Ah. The lots of cybernetic effects. Holy. And those random sounds uh, at the background, they sound like, I don't know, a hellish mobile phone from the future doing calls. I don't know. Retro mobile phone because it sounds like a, a, a retro phone, you know, but... But modernized and playing almost random notes. Holy. Okay. The construction of that drift. Oh. oh and back at the beginning again but so much more aggressive with a lead guitar with Frigian-esque melodies It's crazy, this one's simpler But uh, this one makes you stress more, so maybe it's fitting, it's proper, appropriate. A kind of atmospheric to the end. Huh. I like that. The main rhythm cell, not cell, but pattern. Yeah, the foundation, the rhythm foundation for this was that bam, 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 bam. That it quarter notes at the end to normal quarter note. It's really interesting because the composer had that for a foundation and started playing with different rhythms and different instruments. So he wasn't completely at attached to that main pattern but uh, he used it for a little bit of stability and include more awkward let's say awkward kind of things i don't know i don't know what to say because obviously you cannot top the previous dim the lobby dim i don't know how much time will the people spend in the lobby not as much time as, as fighting against the the boss right i think they should have reversed maybe the songs probably probably the the phoenix shit is top tier is peak is everything i don't know what do you think man 
What do you think? What, what can I tell you? Which one's better or more appropriate for the main fight? Maybe you will have a better opinion on that. And well, thanks for watching. Thanks for freaking listening and for recommending me these bangers, man. Especially the first one going directly to my Spotify or favorite Spotify's uh, list. Have a blast of a day, night, whatever it is, like a phoenix. See you.